What did I learn in Street Fighter? What did I learn in Street Fighter? What I learned from Street Fighter? That no matter what, life is about being the motherfucking best. I was under the impression that street fights were more hand to hand. And that's just it. Foot to foot, sometimes with a knife. No matter how much you learn, I don't care about tears, no matter how much you practice, how good you are, no matter how good you get, you have to be the best. You still don't know shit. It's about beating your friends and kicking their ass no matter what. But this game revolutionized the way I see street fights. Even the best people in the world, somebody better than you, get beaten by people like a grade or two underneath them from time to time because they figured out some weird thing that nobody knew. Just go play for 18 hours, you'll be okay, you'll catch up. I see people in karate gi shooting fireballs and igniting their hands on fire and, and that's what life is really about doing like a dragon punch kind of thing you know everything's coming framed at it doesn't matter You're still learning new things the rising dragon fist if you will oh who knew that that clashed who knew that that prioritized over that i wasn't aware these were things you would see in a, in a street brawl then they come out with new games you can't ever get good at anything so we have a bunch of police officers some of which can also shoot Fireballs. The words get good are the most empty things you could ever hear, but you still have to. I have a lot of respect for the military now. They can shoot, you know, sonic booms. You can't not try to get good. Working hard and being the fucking best of it. They have perfect hair. And I think that's the whole metaphor for the games itself. I wish my hair was that great. No matter how hard you try, there's still gonna be more trying you have to do. Anything can be solved with violence. Ryu's just running around trying to, you know, become the best fighter in the world, traveling on foot with his bag in his back. Then you have this Russian dude, wears underwear, kind of a weirdo. You learn the most from losing. Anyway, he just grabs people. What are they doing? What's the premise of the game? What a monster. Who would do such a thing? Just grab people and violate them and just... They're just beating each other up because fuck it! That's how you get on your way to being the best. By getting beat by people better than you. Whoever used Zangief and all these other characters, Thunderhawk, whatever the hell. By getting knocked down a peg and then realizing, where the hell did I go wrong? You guys need to go to hell. I hate those guys. If somebody disagrees with you, you just fucking... Punch him! Who gives a shit? But I've yet to see any of this stuff in a real street fight. I think this is false advertising. What did I do that let them beat me? Because it's never that the other person beat you. All I see are people with knives. I don't care if this dude's a ninja. That Cody guy, he's a real American hero. It's never that case. Because they've been in the same circumstance as you. Prisoner. Guess that makes sense. He's the kind of guy you'd actually see in a street fight. They just didn't mess up as much as you did. Fucking this guy's got arms that are the size of a watermelon. This guy is looking inconspicuously like JoJo's Bizarre Adventures characters. I'm going in there and I'm trying my motherfucking best no matter what. There is no winning in Street Fighter. Well, let's be honest. Street Fighter sucks. You just don't do as bad as you did last time. That's what I learned from Street Fighter. And that's what I've learned about Street Fighter. That's what I learned in Street Fighter. Hey everybody, it's the Metal here. Thanks for watching the video. Feel free to check out any of the other videos in the end card. We've got a couple of the good stuff we made and like to point out both Aroma Comet and Johnny Burns who donated some nice video for this episode. Just click right there and subscribe while you're at it. And if you really, really like the video, we would appreciate it if you shared. Anyway, we will see you next time. Bye. So, God damn Chun-Li, man. Those fucking legs.